Hi, this is Saev Moten with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsummit.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsummit.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody. Unfortunately, I have to prepare the research a bit earlier than usual since uh, tomorrow I will be out of the office and will not have any access to the computer, at least in the first part of the day. So I decided to make it um, right now because the major situation hardly will change uh, till the beginning of the morning in the Europe. So. Let's start from the daily time frame of the euro currency, see what is going on here. So we see that market is trying to recover from the oversold condition. And that is the price action that we have expected since market really stands in the significant support. Again, that is the harmonic swing, the low of the harmonic swing. Confluence, daily confluence supported oversold. That is also the monthly pivot point and take a look at the natural support of the previous consolidation. So that is rather strong support that market hardly will uh, break right from the first touch, especially since it's tended to sold. In some respect of this area is possible. And you can see that by this close we could even get the small bullish engulfing pattern. Well, that is very probable right here. Well, and on the daily time frame, all price action still looks as we expected. But on the intraday charts, it's not quite as we suggested in the video research. So let's take a look at the hourly time frame. On the hourly time frame, we see that market is calling slightly higher than the target of this ABCD pattern. And that price action that is pulled back from this area, from the result condition, not the thrust. So we can see that some sort of the choppy price action, although it, it turns to the upward, but this is not the thrusting move. Uh, because as we have discussed, this area could be the foundation for market continuation uh, to 138, 138, uh, 30 area, because we have uncompleted weekly ABCD pattern. But this continuation should have the thrusting acceleration to the upside, the momentum uh, move of the market, impulse move to the upside, some sort of that way, but in the opposite direction, some sort of the that price section. This is not that I would like to see. What this price section tells us? There are two possible uh, variants up here. First variant is that market is calling here just because it hasn't touched the target of the ABCD pattern. If we will measure the extensions of that retracements, we'll see that the 1618 of that retracement and 127 of that retracement coincides around 133.35 area. And market could first touch this level before we'll start this thrust move to the upside. That is one possibility. The second possibility is a bit uh, more worrying for the bulls because this could mean that market has no intention to show the reversal and that price action is just the retracement and attempt to correct the oversold condition on the daily time frame. If this is true, market probably will show some sort of the sideway action and then will show some sort of the price action right to the downside and will break the harmony swing and the conf uh, daily confidence support on the daily time frame. So if you hold long as we suggested from this area, since we have suggested to enter long somewhere around this area, then you probably could hold it by but protect your position with the stop loss order. Because if market will returns right back, you will be able to enter right again, but with better price. If you do not have long position, wait. It's better to do either above the 134 than 134.25 area, when market will show some breakout of this resistance to the upside, or if market will show the move, as I said, to the 133.35 area. 
In this case it will be better opportunity to enter along. It will be just safer. That is probably not the three drive pattern because you can see this swing is a bit higher than that one. So it's very flat three drive. I prefer to see the three drives that a bit more steep. Well, um, that's why, as I said, is the conclusion. Uh, just keep an eye on the current situation because it's very important level to watch for. And depending on how market will behave around this, will depend the medium term perspective on the euro currency. If market will fail there and move below the 133.35 area to the downside, that could mean that probably we could expect some deeper move in the daily time frame. That will be not just a retracement already. That will be some sort of the reversal because as weekly time frame pattern as current situation doesn't do do not suggest such deep retracement. This in fact the last hope for the bulls the last level to watch for because other level is levels as I said that stands uh, that stand lower than the current market mm. will be not absolutely uh, in a row with the retracement issue on the daily time frame. That will be a bit another tune already. Well, so keep an eye on this level. Mm. I hope that market will hold above this significant support and we will see the thrusting acceleration after the hitting, for instance, 133.35 area. But anyway, uh, that's the significant level to watch for. And uh, wait the clear signs before take any position in another direction. So let's see how it will turn.